A good afternoon, everybody. I'm choking myself. Good Lord. Good afternoon, everybody. That's right. Snow Crybaby Lifestyle is coming back at you from the cloudy but always lovely Las Vegas, Nevada. It is currently 106 in the PMs and roughly 60 degrees. I'm going to make a short, quick video. Um, something I saw today. It was kind of, kind of, kind of sad that, you know, drivers feel this way. Even sadder that, um, a specific YouTuber endorses this kind of shit um, towards customers. Um, but I thought I'd do, you know, get my part on it because I find it to be total bullshit uh, when it comes to rideshare, the the attitude of some of these drivers and the YouTubers that think this shit kind of shit is okay. So I saw a video this morning of a specific YouTuber uh, endorsing that if the customer ain't paid more or they don't get paid more than $4, that the customers can walk. Um, that's pretty fucked up. Uh, it's pretty messed up that you want to take your issues out with Uber because you don't feel you're getting paid enough because you're either fucking lazy, uh, you just want to sit around and play games instead of actually out there driving. Because I know drivers in LA that smash it out there. Um, so all you assholes that think you ain't getting paid enough and that you feel it's okay that customers can walk because you're not getting $4. That's pretty damn sad. You really need to find another job, and hopefully it's not customer service related. And as far as that YouTuber goes, I hope you never find yourself in a position where because of your inability to pay a certain amount of money or your ability to pay a certain amount of money dictates the service that you get. It's pretty fucking sad that you endorse something like that. And from what I saw, all the drivers that were saying, yeah, 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 they can walk, they can walk, y'all suck. You all shouldn't even be in this game. So um, that's my take on it. Once again, the way I say it, you know, um, and I ain't going to apologize to nobody for the way I talk. You guys know me by now. But, you know, when I see stuff like that, that's pretty damn sad. You have no business being in the customer service gig if that's the way you want to think. If you have issues with the employer that's employing you and paying you, take it out on them. Don't take it out on the fucking customers because you don't feel they're paying enough for the ride. Um, that just shows you're being a fucking hypocrite. And um, that you don't feel that your your worth is much more than somebody else's who may not be able to afford a higher price ride because you lazy ass fucking drivers um, are too lazy to get out there and drive and make that money like you should be. But hey, my take. Uh, remember, you are the creator of your own destiny. Nobody's gonna do it for you. Um, so y'all be safe out there. Like, share, subscribe this video. And um, if anybody that watches this this hurts your feelings, I hope it does. And you know what I hope it does? I hope you need to find another job um, because you don't deserve to be in customer service. And um, karma's a bitch. You will get yours. Um, just remember that. All right. Um, so like I said, Kuno Cry Baby out. You guys have a great night. Bye.